That is where we are going to start right there, developing this story now at 9 o'clock. Two pit bulls attack a Tampa man, dragging away the family's pet poodle before also going after a police officer. It's a pretty bad scene. We're going to go live right now to ABC Action News reporter Isabel Rosales. And Isabel, you spoke with the poodle's owner. What did he tell you happened? The owner had just gotten back home from work and took his poodle named Simba out for a walk like he does every morning. But that is when two pit bulls came out, bit Simba and dragged him away across this lot. Now, Keith Roy George tells me the dogs killed Simba and then started to eat him. A Tampa police spokesperson tells me one of the dogs then attacked a responding officer. That officer shot him dead. The other pit bull eventually found and was restrained and taken away by animal control. The dogs are vicious. It's a vicious dog. I really am hurt. I lost Simba. It's a really friend of our family. It's a part of the family and I'm going to miss him. My grandbaby going to miss him, miss him too. Keith Roy is also familiar with the pit bulls. He says he's been attacked by them before, but managed to beat them away with a stick. He tells me they're typically restrained around the neighborhood. No word yet on the owner or if any charges will be filed. Now, furthermore, Keith Roy tells me he feels thankful, and that is because usually he takes his 10 month old granddaughter out on walks with Simba every morning. This morning, he decided not to. Live in Tampa, I'm Isabel Rosales, ABC Action News.